Tripping on psychedelics while inside VR? Imagine taking LSD and tripping inside virtual reality. Would it increase the psychedelic experience? Well, it may, and that's because of the idea of setting, which means your environment and the objects within it have a great influence on your psychedelic trip. With VR, you can change your environment to anything you want through virtual worlds. You can trip on a Norwegian mountain or somewhere in the Alpha Centauri galaxy. All of this is possible with VR. The influence of virtual reality on the mind is astounding. One study found that VR, just by itself, can reduce pain. It can even help people with opioid use disorder. All of these benefits are made possible by simply changing vision to a virtualized reality. So why not virtualize the visual experience of a psychedelic and then put that in VR? It would be like using VR to have a psychedelic trip. Well, some researchers use VR to create some themes of psychedelic trips, like downward funnels and gridded landscapes of infinity and seemingly endless oceans. Then they gave this VR to people with mild to moderate depression, and they found that these virtualized psychedelic experiences significantly decreased their depressive symptoms. So what would happen if a person was tripping on psychedelics within a psychedelic VR experience? Would it be like tripping inside of a trip? Well, it's not that easy, and I've been spending the last three years of my life researching this. In order to understand how a person's mind works while having a trip inside of a trip, you must first understand how the brain works. And my research involves a lot of brain scans using a technology called functional near infrared spectroscopy or FNIRS. And there's a lot happening in the brain when a person has a psychedelic trip inside VR. We also need to know things like how the eyes perceive light coming from a VR headset. But so far, my research has shown that things I thought would work do nothing. <laughs> And things I thought would do nothing suddenly work. Yeah, bro, analyzing the brain while a person trips inside VR is complex and frustrating. But by the end of my research, hopefully I'll have an answer as to what happens when you trip inside VR. If you want to know more about combining psychedelics in VR, then just watch the full episode on YouTube.